Welcome to the video tutorial of DevAI. Go to Telegram, search for contract DevAI underscore bot, then click start. Choose the network you want to deploy your contract on. Enter the token name. This will be the name of your project. Enter your project sticker. This will be your cash tag. Enter the total supply. This will be the maximum number of tokens that will be available on the chain. Choose a number above 300. Select the maximum wallet percentage. This will represent the maximum a wallet can hold. Then select the maximum transaction percentage. This represents the maximum tokens per transaction. Decide if you want to include tax for your project. Select no if zero. Decide if you want to implement a maximum tax cap of 25% for your project. Input your marketing wallet address. This wallet will be receiving the percentage of taxes allocated for the marketing wallet. Input your dev wallet address. This wallet will be receiving the percentage of taxes allocated for the dev wallet. Input the buy marketing tax without using the percentage sign. You will be asked to input taxes for marketing, liquidity, and dev. Now input the buy liquidity tax. Make sure not to use the percentage sign. Finally, input the buy dev tax without the percentage sign before moving on to defining your sell taxes. Now, select how much taxes will be allocated for marketing when a sell transaction occurs. You will be prompt to input marketing, liquidity, and dev taxes. Now, input the sell liquidity tax. Make sure not to use the percentage sign. And finally, input the sell dev tax. Complete the payment to DevAI as instructed to the designated wallet. Once completed, click on Send Payment button and paste your transaction hash or link. Wait for the payment confirmation message. Then, choose between generating a new wallet or importing an existing wallet by clicking Add Wallet and pasting the private key. If you generate a wallet, make sure you save the private key in a secure place not to lose it. It is time to deploy your contract. Before you deploy, make sure you have enough gas fees to deploy. You need to have BNB when deploying on BSC and ETH when deploying on Ethereum. Afterwards, type slash deploy. Proceed by verifying your contract by copying the slash verify message preceded by the contract address. This action consumes no gas. After the verification process is completed, you can now choose how many BNBs or Ethereums you would like to add to your initial liquidity. Then choose how much of the total supply you would like to keep out of circulation. The remaining percentage will be paired with the LP. Click on Approve Contract to start adding the LP to the DEX. For BSC, the created LP pair will be added to PancakeSwap, while for Ethereum, the created LP pair will be added to Uniswap. After approving, make sure you have enough balance in your wallet for the selected LP amount plus gas fees. Then click on Add LP. You can now choose what you would like to do with your LP tokens. Currently, you can either burn them or keep them unlocked. We highly recommend you either burn or lock the LP to increase investor confidence when launching. In this example, we choose to burn the LP tokens whereas they were transferred to the dead wallet. Now, type slash commands to access the commands menu for your token. Select your token. A list of commands appear on your screen where you can parse functions for your contract directly through DevAI Bot. Keep note that every command you parse consumes gas. Currently, you can directly do the following. Enable trading. 
Change your buy, sell, or transfer taxes. Change the max wallet holding. Change the max transaction limit. Change the swap back percentage. Transfer ownership and renounce ownership. When selecting a function such as changing taxes, max wallet holding, transaction limit, or swap back limit, you are prompted with different options you can revise them to or input the percentage when changing taxes. We enabled trading, change taxes, and renounce the contract to show examples of how the functions are passed. After enabling trading, you can never disable it. When renouncing ownership, it is crucial that you only renounce it when you are ready. After renouncing the contract, you will not be able to parse any more functions. I hope this tutorial has been helpful. Thank you for showing interest in DevAI. Make sure to follow us on social media and join our Telegram at the Raid Contract DevAI for the latest updates and news.